With TCU, UT, and Baylor getting knocked out of March Madness over the weekend, the two Texas teams left standing, Tech and Houston. But there's also a young man from DFW everyone can get behind. And what a homecoming he enjoyed in Fort Worth. And Martin fakes it, gives it now, and Wilson scores. The best part of Kansas sophomore Jalen Wilson living out his wildest dreams was doing it this past week in Fort Worth, less than an hour from where he grew up in front of his two biggest fans. You know, he's still going to always be my baby no matter how old he is. So it's, it's, it's so awesome to see. I mean, it still amazes me that I see my baby in a Kansas uniform. You know, growing up as a child, as a kid, you know, if you can get to Kansas, you know, you didn't probably made it. And it's just so surreal when I look out there and I see my baby. Growing up in Denton, you have to understand, Jalen was born to hoop it up. Not only was his dad, Darrell, a key player on the TCU team in the late 90s, his mom, Lisa, had her own distinguished basketball career playing on the college level in Oklahoma. So do you give them, do you give them like coaching advice in between? Do, All the time. Do you give them oh, yeah. Oh, All yeah. The time. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We both do. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he gets it. He gets it. For my, there's no yeah. one to run. He doesn't get it from us. He gets it from my dad or his mom. I mean, we've all we've all played basketball, so it's just we're a very supportive family. Does he ever get tired and say, "Mom, Dad, come on"? Every now and then. Every now and then. Better not with me. Every now and then, but you know, it's one of those things to where he understands. The, you know, he, he respects what we say. A motto of consistency, Jalen wore number 10 when he rose to new heights at Denton Geyer High School. He wears number 10 to this day, and you could give him a perfect 10 when it comes to never letting the moment overwhelm him. Just coming in and having to play our same type of game, and, you know, even though teams adjust, we still got to stick to what we do best. Chi Town is in Chicago. Sweet 16 for Kansas on Friday. And because it's a family affair, Jalen's mom and dad will be there. We're sitting in the stands and knowing that you're kind of helpless in a sense, like you can't suit up and get out there and contribute anymore. I think it just kind of makes it so much more your anxiety and a blood pressure. Like I'm going to need probably some medication in Chicago. And as many trophies as Jalen Wilson racked up as a little kid in Denton, Texas, Four more wins for he and his Kansas teammates, and this magical journey will be complete. When they play a one shot in moment and, and, and they cut and they show the shot of Jalen and they show the shot of Jalen celebrating, that's when it will. Yeah, don't, don't get the camera on me because I'm sure the mascara will be running. Oh, I'll be crying. Don't, <laughs> twist, don't get it twisted. I will be crying. Jalen's mom, Lisa, points out that she's the only one currently in the family to ever win a championship title. Uh, keep in mind, last year, Jalen entered the NBA draft, but decided to come back for one more year at Kansas. His parents' invite, advice, enjoy the moment because you never know each game could be your last college game. But to see him come back to Fort Worth, you know, he grew up in Denton. He's yeah. this little kid, and now he's this grown, powerful man living out dreams that they say they wish they could have lived yeah, out. So inspiring for his family, but also for the other kids who live around here who are looking up to him. All, all the kids in DFW who have dreams of basketball or even beyond, you know, they can look to someone who says, he's from here. He made it. And if he can do it, I can do it. Yep, yeah, so true.